राजनीति की जो सीढ़ियाँ मैंने चढ़ी है उसमें गांधी परिवार का बहुत बड़ा योगदान रहा इस योगदान के लिए मैं उनका व्यक्तिगत तौर से धन्यवाद करता हूँ political drama in Himachal Pradesh has finally ended the Congress Legislature Party, has chosen Sukhwinder Singh Sukhu as the Chief Minister of the Hill State and Mukesh Agnihotri as Deputy CM. The decision comes a day after the newly elected Congress MLAs passed a resolution authorizing the Congress High Command to select the next leader of the Legislature Party. Meanwhile, supporters of Pratibha Singh raised slogans in a favor on Saturday, soon after reports that the Party High Command had given its nod to Sukhwinder Singh Sukhu. Sukhu will take the oath today at 11 a.m. and the ceremony will be attended by Congress President Mallikarjun Kharge, Priyanka Gandhi Vadra and Rahul Gandhi. Sources so, CNN News 18 claim that Sukhu becomes the CM of Himachal Pradesh. Party High Command had a special formula to incorporate both Sukhu and Birbhadra Singh's family under which Mukesh Agnihotri was decided as CM face and both Vikramaditya and Sukhu were to be deputy CM. Mukesh was the leader of the Congress party for the last five years. Sources say that everything was almost final and observers had initial plan of going to Delhi, get it discussed and approved from high command and implement the plan in the hill state. So this is the latest coming in from the hill state and we're joined by my colleague Akash who brings us more details uh, going across to him. Very good morning to you, Akash. Now, Vikram Aditya uh, was supposed to be deputy CM, Sukhu was supposed to be uh, deputy CM, but now the final uh, decision is that Sukhwinder Sukhu is going to be the CM, his country is CM designate. Mukesh Agnihotri is going to be the deputy CM. So, what quickly changed in the last few hours, Akash? Good morning, Shilpa, first of all, and let me tell you that after a lot of, uh, you know, political meetings and statements and a lot of hustle and bustle for two days, finally, Marshal Pradesh has got its new CM and Sukhwinder Singh Sukhu will be the next CM, Chief Minister of Marshal Pradesh, first. Secondly, talking about the recent development where, you know, it has been mentioned that initial plan was to uh, make Vikramaditya as Deputy Chief Minister. So, you know, we are learning from our sources that Vikramaditya was not happy with the kind of limitations and, uh, you know, all the uh, all the terms and conditions that were set with the post. And, you know, uh, considering the example of Rajasthan, in fact, party high command was very cautious, uh, you know, giving the particular post to Vikramaditya. So Vikramaditya denied the offer. This is what our sources are telling. And, you know, he said that as of now, he wants some time to think over it. And and that's the reason why party finally chose, uh, you know, Mukesh Azmihotri as the chief minister and Sukhvinder Singh Sukhu as the chief minister. Now, Sukhvinder Singh Sukhu, you know, is uh, a, a person who has been in the Congress party from last so many years. He started his career in 1998 from NSUI and, uh, you know, from NSUI to uh, Municipal Corporation and then to uh, becoming the chief of a state Congress. You know, he has come a long way and now finally he's going to be the chief minister. Now we are learning that at 11 a.m., you know, we are going to see the oath ceremony where Rahul Gandhi, Priyanka Gandhi and also the Congress president Malikarjun Kharge would be present. As of now, yes, supporters of, uh, you know, Pratibha Singh still uh, are not happy and they want their Rani Saiba. They wanted, in fact, their Rani Saiba to be the next chief minister. However, party high command has now decided that Sukhinder Singh Sukhu will be the next chief minister. And at around 11, we'll be seeing this court taking ceremony, after which uh, Sukhinder Singh Sukhu will be the chief minister of Himachal Pradesh. Akash, as you're telling us, the Congress party has opted for disruptive change this time around. They've opted for a leader who comes from the grassroots levels. He has worked his way up and has chosen him over what could be a traditional royal choice as going as per the Congress's uh, leaning towards legacy politics. But how are Pratibha Singh's followers going to attack? How are her supporters going to react to this? We know she herself has said she accepts the high command's order. But uh, is there growing dissent within members of the Congress party? 
so not the dissent within the uh, members of the congress party but it is for sure that supporters are not at all happy with the kind of decision that has been made by the party high command but it will be the responsibility of pratibha singh and vikram aditya to give a clear message to the supporters that you know party high command have got their consent for the particular thing also you know talking about pratibha singh and and the legacy that you are talking about uh, shilpa so you know there was a sentiment among uh, people in himachal pradesh that you know uh, yes there there is a legacy of Victor Madhya, but someone else should be given a chance as well. Because talking about uh, you know leaders like Mukesh Agniotri and Sukhinder Singh Sukhu, so they have been in the politics for last so many years, and the, now they are the uh, you know they are tall leaders as well. So uh, there was the sentiment that some other leaders should be given chance as well, and that's the reason why party high command has decided Sukhinder Singh Sukhu's name. Also, you know Sukhinder Singh Sukhu is coming from a constituency which is very important, and Congress has won uh, maximum seats. in that particular constituency and somewhere mm-hmm. the credit goes to sukhinder singh sukhu only and that is the reason why party high command decided that since sukhinder singh sukhu has got support of the mla since sukhinder singh sukhu has been uh, in the congress party for last so many years he has you know uh, he has been given uh, so many responsibilities in the past as well and you know he has always fulfilled those responsibilities that were given by party high command that's the reason why you know his name has been chosen as uh, the next chief minister of uh, himachal pradesh